I did it! Oh my god, I am done with my very first novel. Sparks and shadows. Oh my god, I'm finished. I'm gonna cry. 150,000 words and I am done. Hello and welcome back to my channel or welcome if you are new. Um, my name is Jessica Nicole and I write YA fantasy romance novels. Um, and I just finished my first one. So that's what this video is basically about. Please ignore how gross I know I look and sound right now. I have been sick and so like the skin on my mouth, my nose, all around this area is like chapped and flaking off. It's really gross. And um, I'm on the mend now, thankfully. I hate having like summer colds spring colds but yeah I got a cold because uh spring is transitioning to summer here where I live and um my job is a little AC happy so I like spend my day freezing and I do have a little space heater but it's just like not enough and so I caught a cold because uh like the kids in my class have a cold and then I get a cold and we just all share the cold but yeah uh anyway back to my book um i finally finished my first book sparks and shadows um as you saw from the first clip i finished it this weekend i finished it on saturday actually the last 2000 words i wrote the last uh part of the last chapter which ended up being 2000 words this saturday and um it is a YA fantasy romance that's what i love to read that's what really got me into reading for fun when I was uh, in junior high and so that's what I like to write and uh, it's about a girl who kind of discovers her own destiny um, through the help of her friends and uh, her family and so yeah I'm really excited to put it out there in the world and I'm excited for you guys to see the finished product I started working on this book way back two years ago in quarantine and I just now got it to a point where I'm happy with it where I'm ready for people to see it and meet these characters and uh, just hopefully love it as much as I do um, so the plan is for me to self-publish this book in June uh, early June and I actually made the cover myself uh, with Procreate and PixArt just on my iPad. Um, right now it's just going to be an ebook and my hope is to uh, get it made into paperback and an audiobook as well. So um, yeah, I'm just really excited. Uh, like you saw in the clip, the final word count is a little bit over 150,000 words. Um, that's just how long it took to tell the story and since I've got a touch of OCD that's probably how long all of my novels will be because I like things to be even and the same um so that's the plan um I believe going forward I don't want to take two years to write every single book because I have lots of stories that I want to tell so you can probably expect me to release three books a year maybe maybe like yeah three books a year i'll work on each book for around four months and hopefully by the end of four months it's something i'm happy with i do love this book so so much uh it's a story that i've been wanting to tell um since i was 16. i think i wrote my very first draft of this book or started it when i was 16 finished it around 18 um and it was absolute crap i don't know where it is right now or i would like share it i'd love to have it to like just compare my writing but yeah and so i just like continued to work on it i worked on other things i finished other things but this was always just a story that i kept coming back to and i feel like it's the story that i was meant to tell um and i finally told it and i'm so proud of myself for that and I'm so just excited that um I can't believe I did it really and I 
can't believe I'm so like I'm just overwhelmed I don't even know how to feel and I can't wait to actually like just start something new because I am so in love with the story I'm so glad that I wrote it I think it's a beautiful story wonderful meaningful and just everything that I love about fiction but I also have been working on it for years and years and years and this particular uh, incarnation of it for two years um, so I'm excited to kind of close that chapter and start working on something else um, I have a couple of ideas for what I want to work on next um, I've had an idea for a little Red Riding Hood retelling uh, in my head for a long time and I think now is just about the right time to do that so I think that's what I'll do next and I'll be taking you guys along for that journey so I'm gonna be working on that this summer and hopefully be putting that out in the fall so that's basically it for this update um yeah I'm just so happy and uh can't wait for you guys to read it